नमस्कार मित्रों इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर बिल्डिंग ए पावरफुल क्वाडकॉप्टर ड्रोन यूजिंग द रेडियो लिंक क्रॉस फाइट फाइट कंट्रोलर एंड येस वी आर ऑल्सो एडिंग ए जी पी एस एंड ए कैमरा टू टेक थिंग्स अप अनोज सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड बाय बिल्डिंग द ड्रोन फ्रेम टू मेक द फ्रेम स्ट्रॉन्ग येट लाइट वेट आई एम यूजिंग ट्वेल्व एम एम एलमिनियम स्क्वायर ट्यूब्स यू विल फाइंड ऑल द डायमेंशन एंड ड्रॉइंग फाइल्स लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बिलो सो फील फ्री टू चेक दम आउट All right, our frame is ready. Now let's jump into Fusion 360 to design a custom canopy. The design is actually inspired by a shark head, just for a cool and aerodynamic look. Once the design was done, I printed it using my 3D printer, and it turned out really well. I also added cavities in the canopy for headlights, and to control these lights, we will need a PWM switch. And for that, I used GLZ PCB to get a custom PCB made. I started by designing the circuit in EasyDA, converted it into a PCB and downloaded the GUBA file. Then I logged on to jlcpcb.com to order the PCBs. JLCPCB is a popular manufacturer of printed circuit boards offering multi-layer PCBs, flex PCBs, PCB assembly services and SMT stencils. Besides PCBs, they also provide 3D printing and CNC machining services. They offer almost everything you need to prototype a product. Their user-friendly interface makes the ordering process easy even for beginners. To order PCBs, upload a GUBA file on JLCPCB's website, select your PCB settings and order high quality PCBs at a reasonable price. Since I used their PCB assembly service, the whole process was super easy and I am really happy with the quality. If you are also planning to order your own PCBs, check out jlcpcb.com. The link is available in the description. With that done, our canopy is ready. Now let's fix the electronics in the frame.
Now coming to the wiring, while connecting the ESCs, make sure you follow the motor sequence diagram properly. Connect each ESC to the corresponding pads on the flight controller. And if you find any motor spinning in the wrong direction, just swap any two wires of the ESC to reverse the direction. Before continuing the assembly process, let me give a shout out to LTM for sponsoring today's video. LTM Designer is a powerful and user-friendly software trusted by engineers and makers worldwide to create high-quality PCBs quickly and accurately. And with LTM 365, your entire team stays connected. It seamlessly brings together everyone from mechanical designer to manufacturing specialists on a single cloud platform, streamlining your electronics design journey from concept to production. If you are ready to take your electronics design skills to the next level, there's a special trial offer just for YouTube viewers. Click the link in the description and get started today. Now let's get back to the assembly process. For the flight controller programming and setup, I have added a separate video link in the description, make sure to check it out.
As you can see, the drone is flying super stable. I am getting a flight time of around 5 to 6 minutes with a 3S 3000mAh LiPo battery. I have also tested features like altitude hold, position hold and return to launch and everything worked just as expected. I hope you enjoyed this project. If you like the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more awesome DIY builds and tutorials. That is it for today guys. I'll see you in the next one.